Well, hello, beautiful collective. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Thank you so much for all your subscribes, your likes, and your comments. It's all truly appreciated here. Let's find out the current energy for these soulmate Saturn in separation spirit. What advice do you have concerning the soulmates in separation? What are their next actions? What are their feelings? What are they going through? And what can the collective expect? Hmm. The dolphin collar. Joyful friendships, loving health, pure. The angel gate. Cleansing, protection, and blessings. Dawn Watcher, a caretaker, a guardian, or support. Oh. The Spirit of Spring, freedom to take action and power. It's like a renewal. Hmm. Plant yourself here. Integration, embodiment, grounded action. Mm. Solid foundation. Sophia, the divine plan. Wisdom, intelligence within, destiny. Mm. The wasteland, sustainability, slow down, tend to your garden, plant yourself here. So, the mystic rose, compassion, devotion, humility, humanity, and grace. Rapture, sensuality, love, devotion, romance, uh -huh. ecstasy, and pleasure is here. So if you thought you were in a wasteland, you're not going to be. Rapture. After the storm. There's a tower going on. Loving, devoted, oh, for crying out loud, this person is playing frickin' mind games. What about this? Okay, so somebody broke your heart, hey? They did this out of jealousy and envy. I think that this person was in back and forth energy. Here you are. Oh, you. Oh, come on. So this person was breadcrumbing you? This person did this deliberately to make you jealous? Break your heart? Act like a player? Giving to two, they did this deliberately to, because they were jealous. Maybe you got fed up with their player ways. Maybe you they tried to keep you trapped, you know, in your mind, in worry and anxiety. They were playing mind games. They were. Yeah. They're 
like they were trying to teach you a lesson. This was a sacred union. It's almost like you didn't put up with their player ways. So they retaliated to make you jealous. I don't like this energy. Yeah, they did it intentionally. They knew that you were going to see something. Started a fling or a one night stand. Out searching for greener grass. And now they're regretting it. They tried to teach you a lesson. They did indeed. They tried to teach you a lesson. Uh, you know, it's they were the player. And it's like this person knew that you were going to see something. They tried to make you jealous. They figured that you were going to communicate. That you'd be crying over spilt milk. That you'd be crying your eyes out. They were trying to make you regret ever getting away. Ego. While well, whatever they went searching for, they're regretting it. Yeah. Now they want, they figured, oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Now they want a second chance, okay? They retaliated because they figured that you were never going to get away. They just figured, you know, they'd make you worry, they'd make you stressed out, that you would be jealous, this person likes a lot of attention, thinks that they're very... Um, thought they were above you somehow. Thinking that if they put you in a competition, that you would worry so much. Now, <laughs> they did this to their true love. Now they can't, they're, it's backfired on them somehow. They want to return. So they figured by making an offer to another lover that somehow you would hear about it. But instead you spoke your truth, held your ground, ended the relationship and moved on. And now it's ending with the other lover. You trusted your intuition. Why was this person acting so cold? Why was this person dragging their feet? So they entered into a karmic relationship to make you jealous. Now they're being judged for juggling. You're single, abundant. Uh, see? Stable and they're broke due to a child and now they're so they're depressed because they're stuck. That's the truth. They're burdened. Comes around, goes around. You're the star, so you're on the ascension, and their greed has gotten the better of them. Drinking, partying, moving toward sexual encounters, driving around being the fool. Well, why are they going through a tower? Because you ended it with them. That's the truth. It's their path. They let it. Like a fool. Took a leap of faith on some family connection and now they're trying to protect their money. <laughs> Manipulated. Deception. 
tricked. Oh, you see, they were, it was a plan. Smoke screen, now they're betrayed. Feel backstabbed because you were ignoring them. So they were trying to get even. This is getting even. So you may have called this person out on their BS. You may have called this person out on what they were doing. And they did this deliberately to make you jealous. So if they're posting things online and they're doing the most to make you get attention, they were trying to get your attention because they felt like you were ignoring them. They involved another lover to make you jealous. It's retaliatory energy. And now they're angry because they feel betrayed that you freed yourself. Who does this? Who does this to get attention? They were seeking attention because they felt ignored by you you had enough of their bullshit that's what this is saying and now they want to return and have a new beginning with you why because you're glowing you're wealthy or gaining wealth you get a lot of attention you could be in the spotlight they did this out of revenge they were scheming. They were vengeful. They were trying to make you jealous deliberately. And now it's backfired on them. Hmm. Well, they went right to a karmic. So they were trying to teach you a lesson. Like, nobody does this to me. Nobody ignores me. This person wanted to be doted on. And the collective energies are not chasers, okay? They have too much self-worth and too much value and too much confidence to go running after some fool. And this person retaliated, tried to make you jealous by entertaining third parties, having flings, knowing that you would notice, thinking you were going to chase them. And they got betrayed because you didn't chase. They felt betrayed by you because you didn't chase their ass. I can't believe this person. All up in their ego. Like, oh, they tried to, they were stressing you out. They were making you worry. Sleepless nights, high anxiety was a plan. It was a trap. This person was just too much. So they like a lot of attention, see? They're attention seeking. So this person deliberately tried to make you jealous by entertaining another lover. Why? Because probably you stood up to this person, set some boundaries. Maybe they were ignoring you. Maybe they were giving you very little. You may have questioned this person and they didn't like it. Told you, you're too confident for that BS. So they chose a karmic. A deceptive karmic. Thinking that you were going to spy on them, that they would, that you would see them, they, it's intentional. They are doing things intentional or were. They deliberately, intentionally sought out a karmic energy, but they didn't know that it was a karmic. They were doing this to like make you jealous, that to get attention, that you would notice them. Feeling sorry for themselves. Headed straight to Five of Pentacles for attention. See? They wanted to be noticed. 
because maybe you abandoned them or left them out in the cold or whatever. They're headed straight to poverty. This is justice. Karmic justice being served. And that's what the karmic did. Now they've been hurt. This person was a player. Stressing you out all the time. Fear. Trying to like... This karmic is now stressed out. Somebody is pushing the karmic away. They don't want to be a cheater no more. They're all played out. It's all a mind game. I'm telling you right now. That's the truth. This person didn't want you to get away. And when you separated from this person or whatever, because they were moving so slow, they in, made you cry, treating you like another option. Yeah, other lovers. Putting you in a competition. Well, they were manipulating and now they're getting a tower. Now they're like waiting for the past person. You blocked them. They were given to two. They went to somebody who they were juggling, who they shouldn't have trusted, and now they're feeling rejected it's the king of wands reaping what they sow thinking about their happiness thinking about their soulmate connection wanting to come back around again they did this based on ego they were planning it they put a lot of thought into this scheming and that's why they chose the karmic and made this offer to go toward a and now they're angry. They did it to retaliate on you. Immature. It's for jealousy. Somebody came up with a bright idea. Oh, the, the collective will be jealous. You know, they'll come charging in. They'll come chasing you. A friend told them this or a family member, someone very immature. Oh, go entertain another lover. Then the collective will come chasing after you. Now they got betrayed. Yeah, they did it to make you jealous. And now it's backfiring because they're heavily burdened. And now they want... Oh, Jesus. Fool with their money. Yep, foolish mistake. Whatever, damn, now they're pinching pennies and they're still holding on to your energy. So who taught who a lesson here? The collective wasn't playing a mind game. The collective spoke the truth. I'm not going to be treated as an option. You don't spend any time or energy or effort into this relationship. Go. They hurt you, but you walked away. You protected yourself by walking away. That's the truth. The universe probably, um, yeah, it's like this isn't going anywhere. What do you want me to do? Wait for my whole life? You want to go? Go. Truth hurts. Spiritual truth. You spoke the truth to this person and they did not like it. So they retaliated and now it's backfiring on them. They did this to teach you a lesson. Oh, I'll make them jealous, make them chase, make the collective do this. It backfired on them. They knew darn well that you were going to see them with the karmic. And they figured you were going to get jealous, chase after them. And when you didn't chase them, 
they felt betrayed, ignored. So they entertained this karmic energy to make you jealous. They may have had a karmic child now, and now they're settled down with someone who they didn't want in the first place. They figured they would have a fling. Some immature, younger family member told them, Oh, uh, the collective will get jealous. Make them chase you. Make them chase you. You're above them. They're gonna, they'll chase after you. Wrong. You spoke your peace. You spoke your mind. And this person pouted like a big baby. Oh, fine then. I'll go make you jealous. I'll go entertain a third party. I'll teach the collective a lesson. Looks like the lesson's being taught to them. They're not doing so good. And now they want you back. Missing your pure joyful friendship and the loving help that you sent to this person you were a caregiver you know you were a guardian sent to them to support them you were a blessing to this person and they decide to play some silly mind game with you to make you jealous i don't believe this person who does that Like, you have to ask this person's character. Who in good character would do something so foolish and reckless at, instead of having a conversation, instead of just having a heart-to-heart, -heart, you know why they didn't? Because they would have to swallow crow. They would have to address their shadow side. They would have to address their issues. So instead of doing that, they decide to involve a karmic energy to make you jealous. They were playing a mind game. This person's used to being chased. They were in their ego. They were on their high horse. They were thinking they were above you. And they were going to make you crawl. I don't like their energy. It's backfired. That's why karmic justice is here. Because you had pure intentions. You had pureness. They did not. They were going to teach you a lesson. But they're the ones getting taught the lesson. You're reaping the rewards. Take care.